Hello YouTube, welcome to Chris and Tim's Simple How To's, and I am Tim. Alright, today I'm going to go over with you, uh, if you're downloading your video drivers, you get this 7-zip data error. Uh, also, sometimes underneath it'll say um, archive is corrupt or something along that line. Um, usually this is like a, a conflict. Um, if you got a new video card, per se, all right, um, make sure you use a CD to download the drivers first then go to the NVIDIA website and then update your driver um, and you won't get this error and if you are getting this error just because you're trying to update your video card um, which has happened to a couple of friends of mine uh, let me show you the trick that's going to work for that all right uh, you want to go up here to start and go into your device manager DEV usually pops right up for me when I type in that or you have, might have to spell it out all right open that up Go to your display driver adapters. Uh, in my case, I have the uh, NVIDIA GeForce GTX 650 Ti Boost. Very awesome card. Um, and I have it through Asus. All right. You want to click on uninstall. Then you want to make sure you delete all software for this device. Okay. Uh, then you click OK. I'm not going to do it because uh, I have everything working pretty smooth right now. All right. After you've done that, your screen's going to get kind of big. Uh, probably might black out for a second and come back. All right, let's get out of here. I'll shut this. Get rid of this 7 zip data error. All right. Now, once you've done that, what you want to do is you want to go into your control panel and see if anything that has to do with the NVIDIA, just go ahead and delete it. Okay? Also, once you're done doing that, double check um, in your computer, uninstall or change a program and uh, look for it in here too as well now sometimes it might conflict and some of the things might not uh, delete um, sometimes this physics driver doesn't delete don't don't put too much emphasis into it it's you know uh, it's just something that's buggy and it didn't affect me at all okay um, then after you're done with that go ahead and put your CD in there all right if you don't have your CD all right whatever whoever made your video card and I'm not talking about Nvidia Whoever actually does the cooling system, like uh, Asus or MSI, Gigabyte, um, EVGA, just to name a few, um, go to their specific website and download the driver for that card. From the website, you're going to get the all the drivers you need. If you go to NVIDIA, um, a lot of times they're just updates for the video uh, card, and basically you'll end up with that data error, or it'll say you know it doesn't recognize this card or something like that. Um, Real simple, like I said, uh, if you don't have the CD, make sure you go to the manufacturer website. If you do have the CD, use the CD, then go to NVIDIA to update the website, and you should not have that 7-zip data anymore. Um, my name's Tim. I hope this worked for you. Um, if you guys are interested, please subscribe, leave me a message, and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. Uh, thank you very much. Have a great day and a better tomorrow. Be safe.